Hey guys, I'm just moving. Today we're reviewing the new season of Star Wars The Clone Wars, which is season 7. It's not too new now, it's like two months old. Um, and it's just about sort of the, the end of the Republic as sort of what uh, Revenge of the Sith was. So stuff I liked about this uh, last season, that was 12 episodes, a little too short in my, in my opinion, but yeah, whatever. Uh, the last four episodes are fantastic. I know you probably heard this at least a thousand times, but the last four episodes were amazing. They were like, I wonder if... The, it would be cool if you can intertwine them with Revenge of the Sith. But, uh, the first four were fine. Metal Force sucked. Getting to that a little later. But then the animation, too. The animation was fantastic. It looked great. It was a gritty dark, um... You know, sort of like, sort of like before, but, you know, they made it look better. And the combat was amazing. You know, Ray Park came back to do, uh, Dark Maul. And then the story, too. The story was fantastic. I know everyone was... I know there's people that are sort of ticked that they went away from the Ahsoka graphic novel. Not graphic novel. Um, just novel that they were using for most of the time in Clone Wars. Like, they went away from that at the end and how she escaped and gave Rex and took Rex's chip out. Or how Rex lost his chip. But, um, besides, I, I, I didn't mind that. I, I didn't read the novel, so I don't really know. I might, though. I don't know. Ahsoka's not, like, my favorite character in Star Wars. There's better, but Ahsoka's not bad. Um, but yeah, the story was amazing, just besides for the middle four. Which, getting into the cons, uh, the middle four were terrible. Um, yeah, he just didn't, he just didn't want to watch him at all. Yeah, there's, I was just like, okay, I, I know the, I know the, uh, other four are good, so I'm just gonna powerhouse through these, but, yeah. And the next, though, and then also some of the voice acting, mainly in the middle four episodes. There were some of the, the first four weren't as solid, weren't too solid either, but, you know, they, they were better than the middle four. I enjoyed the first four episodes. In my opinion, you could have just stretched out the last four for eight episodes and done the middle four. And now, or just come with a better storyline for Ahsoka and what she's doing, because that was terrible. Because, I don't know, the first four, they had choices. Or was it? Wait. Wait. No, no, that happened in the last four. But, um, yeah, I don't know. The, the first four ex explained sort of uh, how Anakin was going a little dark, which I like that. But then the, the middle four... I don't know, they explained what Ahsoka was doing. I guess you need to know that for... Yeah, I don't know. Otherwise, though, Star Wars The Clone Wars Season 7 was a great season. I gave it an 87%. Definitely recommend checking it out if you're a Star Wars fan or just you want to look, watch some good TV show episodes and you have Disney+. Plus. So, yeah, see you next time, movie fans.